Hi folks, mid morning back at John Norris and Penrith. Um, a couple of reels that have come in I want to talk to you about briefly after I've talked about a book. Uh, a gentleman has brought in this, which is uh, Tips The Salmon Fly by George M. Kelson. This is a rare copy, it's a 1901 first edition. You can see by the condition of the cover here, the gold on it is crisp, the burgundy is lovely, there's no stains inside is nice and tight you will see far fewer of these than you will of the original kelson salmon fly books now this is going into the mullocks auction in the new year so always have a log on to mullock jones auctions um, and just in a search book put in kelson and this will come up this is a super super condition copy I, I don't think i've seen one as clean as this in many years so that's one to look for in the auction site um, on the other purchases um, all sorts of stuff coming in. We've got a Billy Pate tarpon reel, which of course you would expect in the middle of Cumbria. Um, this is a left hand one, 90 reverse, which is mint in box. Lovely. We have, of course, after saying I haven't seen one for ages, a Hardy Zane, another one turns up. So, great start to the day. But the interesting little reel is this this is a Hardy Marksman 4 5. This is called the Hubless reel. So, if you look in the centre, peekaboo. It's got no scent of spindle in it. Because there is a large dial on the back, a lot of people think that's the drag adjuster. Well, it's not. That's your spool release. These are a fixed drag reel. If you listen, and, and it's the same tension left or right hand wind. So there's no need to swap any internals of it. If you're fishing left to right, all you do is strip the line off and rewind it on um, in a different direction. So great reels, lightweight, large arbor. So the core is very big. Uh, this will be going on to the We Buy Fish and Tackle website shortly, along with the Golden MLA, which is a limited edition that's coming this morning. So we're on good volume, high quality stock here at John Norris. I have to go now because I bought some pheasant socks and I'm going to buy some socks with a chicken. That's the next thing I'm going to buy. So always check back, always like and share the videos and uh, we'll come back later on today and see what else it brings. Keep looking back.